It takes serious talent to conquer this insane 600 meter, 24 obstacle course in full body armor while carrying weapons. Rope climbs, river crossings, and a few other surprises are designed to smoke the upper body and leave the weak behind. If that isn't enough, a live fire obstacle will penalize gassed and accurate warriors. It comes down to speed, agility, and strength to win this challenge. And a one year supply of nutritional supplements complements of MRI performance. We're at T1G, we're about to go through the obstacle course. We're about to do the O course. And we're getting ready to get really tired. My game plan is just to go fast over the obstacles and kind of catch my breath in between. Probably pace myself, be ready for those six plates to where I don't get docked some time on that. None of it looks good at all, it just all sucks, to be honest. I see a whole lot of suck. Yeah, we're definitely gonna get wet and dirty, so that's just gonna, I guess you're just gonna have to embrace the suck. Go! I tell you, Broly didn't do enough rope training before he came here. I figured uh, it's better to take your time, get over an obstacle, instead of taking a penalty. Uh, first rope was good. First obstacle, you know, getting in it clean, no big deal. Uh, knew I had an elevated heart rate after that. Saw what was coming up ahead, just tried to pace myself through it. Took a little bit of the MRI black powder, started feeling pretty good. I feel like I had a lot more in me. I didn't get tired as fast. One of the events I thought was gonna be the simplest, just walking up and down the wood. I eat on that twice. Uh, it's slippery, man. But I expected that. I mean, I expected to slip a couple times. Hardest obstacle had to be the uh, climbing the inverted water obstacle. That yeah, sucked. Outstanding. Once that rope smokes you, you're pretty much uh, whew, just trying to hang on. I don't know, it was what it was, and can't take it back. So it makes your uniform heavier, and just makes everything else tougher. So. Monkey bars have to take a quick breather. Slow, smooth, smooth, fast. Keep it hanging in there. You got it. Two more, two more, two more. Last one. It, yes, that was awesome. Physical fitness, you know, it's an important thing, uh, especially within the special operations community. You want to take care of your body because your body's going to take care of you. My pistol got clogged up in mud, and one of the obstacles where I had to crawl under. As soon as I pulled it out of the hose, I just knew it was going to jam, regardless of what gun you had. Missed one, and then had a malfunction. Took some of my camel back, spilled water on it, trying to get some of that dirt loosened up. Trigger kept failing. Probably had some goo in there, didn't have time to fix it. I did miss one target, a little disappointed with that. If you miss something, you got to think what's beyond. It could be a you know, civilian or somebody innocent or something like that, so you, you can't be missing jobs. The uh, rope climb wasn't as bad as I thought it was. Now there was a six foot wall or even the uh, decline wall. So uh, I felt pretty good about that. I wouldn't say it's a winning performance, but you know, middle, probably middle of the pack. Just looking at the guys, they're all younger, fit guys. So, you know, hopefully I'm top three. I'd be happy with that. I think I owned this course. I only had one penalty. That was just the shooting. I won't let that happen again. Hey guys, I know my obstacle course can be pretty brutal. Add on 60 pounds of gear and you have got to be in serious shape to win this thing. One of you does get to go home with some bonus goodies from MRI Performance. The warrior with the fastest time and recipient of a one year supply of supplements from MRI Performance is Derek.
From the cliffs of Omaha Beach to the mountains of Afghanistan, sometimes you have to climb to get to the fight. Welcome to Cliffhanger. <laughs> <laughs>